Hello everyone, I wanted to make this video really quickly just to point out that one, you can use the fruits you get from the raid boss in order to increase the potential of all pals. You don't need to breed that by the way. Like you can do some breeding and that's how I made my new as begun. But you can just skip all that and basically use the power fruit in order to increase the attack or the life fruit or something like that. Because believe me it helps a lot and reduces a lot of the breeding time and by the way also this is my perfect 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 Belenoir the ass kicker sure it has only 20 pal souls because I think I'm missing on life but yeah in terms of RNG this is the absolute perfect Belenoir so yeah I also made this video because there was a bug and I want to give special thanks to Terminator TV for letting me know because I literally had no idea this fix was even a thing so we are going back and testing all of that but before that i want to show you my absolute perfect five pals we have bill and War the ass kicker with 2100 base attack and by the way when i say base i am counting the stars and the pal souls so yeah the only time i don't say base attack is when i use some buffs like food buffs or hook rates so yeah and my second one is ass begun with 1800 base attack my uncle 1800 base attack with dark wisp and divine disaster the same with as begun with dark wisp my ultimate brony 2000 attack with dark wisp and finally and i think this is probably going to be the strongest pal in the game jet dragon the perfect attack i want to rename him to something cooler but uh, yeah for now this this is good because i have jet dragon the perfect speed and whatever the reason i think this is the strongest pal is because it's a 2000 attack while having the ability to attack while hopping on and the missiles the missiles do absolute shit ton of damage i remember when this was 1800 i managed to beat victor and shadow beak using this as the damage powerhouse i did use also a frostalian boss just to tank some damage while this recovers but in terms of damage it was just jet dragon and some rockets i like i did use the legendary rocket launcher but yeah if you want to also see the damage with hook rates let me show you like hook rates and locomoco buff first we have shadow beak my uncle with 3200 this is absolutely amazing. Having Dark Wisp and Divine Disaster with 3200 is gonna be absolutely crazy. Then we have As Begun with 3300 and a Dark Wisp. Then we have Belenoir the Ass Kicker with 3800. This is by far the highest damage in the game. I haven't tried uh, Jormantide Ignis like the limits, but I do want to try when we get an exclusive fire passive skill but yeah this is absolutely incredible i mean she deserves the high attack because you cannot ride her so basically you're gonna have to wait for the cooldowns after that we have ultimate brony with dark wisp with 3600 attack this is also absolutely incredible and finally which sadly cannot benefit from the hook rates and cannot benefit from any pal in the game currently is my jet dragon the perfect attack with 2400 this is probably gonna end up with 37 or 3800 when we get a pal like who creates for dragons which by the way also as begun can benefit from it because as begun is both dark and dragon and i wonder if we're ever gonna get a pal that buffs two types of damage because that means maybe as begun can become crazy amazing by getting double the effect but who knows currently i'm just waiting for the next patch because dragon types are the only types in the whole game that do not have any pal that buffs their damage so i'm just waiting for the next patch because i know there will be a low level pal like hook rates or gobfin or something that buff damage and in terms of jet dragon dragon damage so yeah hopefully we get that next patch because if that happens jet dragon is 
like hands down the best there's nothing better than jet dragon you cannot find anything better than jet dragon with four dragon buffs so yeah let's uh let's beat some ass with some bell and war because that's what we wanted to do thank you again terminator tv for letting me know i had no idea the patch even happened so yeah hopefully they also fixed the fucking partner attack because for some reason it wasn't working I mean, I have to check with previous footage, but oh, wait, wait, no, no, no. It is more. Oh, wait, they fixed it. Not just the damage, the, uh, the, uh, also the duration of this attack. If you remember, watch like the previous video. For some reason, when she does like the beam attack and she's in the, oh, wait. Oh my God, it works instantly. She, they fixed everything. Look, it still damages. Before, it wouldn't damage when it, like, spreads out. I'm so happy they fixed it. Okay, wait. This may actually mean Belenoir is an absolutely amazing pal now. Holy fucking shit. And the cooldown is already up. Like, bro, I can use it again. Oh my god. Th that's a level 50 pal, by the way. What, what the fuck are you... Come here, come here, come here. Get a bit. <laughs> Bro, this is so amazing. This is so damn amazing. You got fucked. Even before my cooldown was up. Holy shit. Yeah. And by the way, if you're wondering, uh, I do have the regeneration at maximum. Just to test out the attacks. Normally, I would take her out of the fight and then release her again. Just to make her regenerate. But yeah, this is just for the purposes of showing you damage. And yeah, that's, that's about it.